Rachel, you're obviously um, reigning Women's Premiership <coughs> Champions and considering the last try today and your performance out on the pitch today, it seems like you really don't want to let, let that title go. No, absolutely. I think like from last year we just want to build on that success and keep trying to get better but we know that everybody in the Tyrrells Premier this year have improved so we've got to make sure that we take every opportunity that we can and you know, finishing playing right to the 80th minute is really important to us. And um, you, you took a lead into half time, but it did seem like you were slightly disappointed with the first half performance from your body language. Do you think that's fair to say? What was, fed, what was said at, at the half, in, in the half time interval? Yeah, I think, you know, in parts we were really um, pleased with what we had done, but our discipline let us down um, and it allowed Ross to get back into the game and allowed them to get some control and momentum. So we went in at half time, like talking about our discipline and making sure that we were trying to play in the right areas of the field. What are your reflections so far on this season? I know there's uh, still a potential final in the second leg of this semi-final to come, but what are your reflections on the Tyrrells Premier 15s in the first season? I think it's really exciting. I think every single team has um, raised the game and raised the standards. Um, I think when you go into each week of, of a Premiership game, you know whether it's us versus Hartbury or Hartbury versus um, Bristol or Saracens versus Loughborough, nobody definitely knows the result. So it's that's what makes it so exciting that you know everybody's up for a fight for for the title and everyone keeps um, working really hard and I think it, you know, the standards have raised and that's why the competition is so competitive. And now you're taking a six point lead into the second, second leg next <coughs> week against Wasps. Um, do you reckon the home advantage and the fact that you can build on your performance today will, will, that, will get you over the line? Yeah, I think you know, we're, we're pleased that we got the win and next weekend we'll be looking to do the same thing and, and try not to rely on points difference to be um, what we um, focus on because you know, we just want to be able to use our home ground as that small advantage that we have um, and come away with a win next week.